So my question is for you, Bill. It's kind of backtracking to your SNL days. I have two. Um, Stefan was an amazing character who I still every day am like obsessed with. <laughs> but I wanted to know what was your hardest career obstacles post SNL, and how did you and John Mulaney form the idea of Stefan? Um, well, John and I came up with Stefan because um, two things. One, he got a, an email from some guy saying you have to come to this club, and the and the email said, you know, this club has everything. Blank. It had that rhythm to it, and it was in this email. And one of the things in the email was the club had a room full of broken glass, and we just went, what? <laughs> you know. And then I had this thing where there was this barista that I would go to every morning. Um, and grab coffee, and 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 he was kind of he didn't sound like Stefan or dress like that, but he just kind of had that essence about him. And I would talk to him, and then John, you know, ha, you know, so John was smart enough to say, well, "What if your barista guy did the did did this?" But a lot of credit towards Stefan should go to to John Mulaney. I think that guy. I mean, he wrote. He writes the whole time. I mean, the guy's a genius. I mean, he, I don't know where, I'm just like everyone else, that's why I was laughing, because I, I didn't know where this stuff came from. Um, and then, hardest career obstacle post SNL. I don't know, I feel like I've been pretty lucky. Um, I mean, I, I, I don't know, I, I felt maybe I was missing something, or maybe I was weirdly optimistic, because I left SNL and everyone was saying, you okay? You think things are going to be all right? And I, I'm like, yeah, I, I think so. I hope so. You know, um, I don't know. I, I was just happy to be able to spend more time with my kids, <laughs> to be honest. <laughs> just.